Hello viewers, I am your host Rohit Khurana on Intellect Digest and today we have two very interesting phones. These are budget smartphones, the Geoni Pioneer P2 and Zolo A500s. These are very close when it comes to pricing, features as well as form factor and they offer good value for money. Both of these devices run Android Jelly Bean 4.2 are powered by dual core processor has 512 MB of RAM and come with some sort of freebies as well as special features. So in this video I'll give you a quick comparison between the Geoni Pioneer P2 or P2 and the Zolo A500s. Let's get started. Starting with the build and form factor of these two phones. They look very different from each other. The Zolo A500s here comes in different colors whereas the Pioneer P2 comes in two colors. The color options on Zolo include a blue, a black, a red and a white. Whereas on P2 you get it in white as well as grey. The one we are testing here is white in color. They both have a 4 inch display on the front with the same display resolution of 480 by 800 pixels on these two devices. They both have touch capacitive buttons at the bottom which come up when you touch it. And there is a front facing camera on both the devices. Both have a 5 megapixel fixed focus camera on the back and there is a VGA front camera on both these phones. Both support 3G, Wi-Fi and are dual SIM and the battery capacity of Geoni Pioneer P2 is larger at 1700 mAh compared to the 1400 mAh battery provided on the Zolo A500N. Design language is also very different for these two phones while the Zolo uses matte finished plastic with a glossy piece up here around the camera rest of it looks very well designed with a good combination of matte and gloss. Whereas on the other hand side the Geoni P2 uses a very familiar design language which uses some gloss, some metal over here, large buttons and a glossy plus matte finished bag. It is slightly shiny but in matte finish. The overall visual appeal of this phone makes it look more rich compared to this one whereas the Zolo A500 looks more sporty. So if you want a rich look you will probably go for Pioneer P2 whereas if you like sporty things you would probably end up with the A500S. There is difference in the profile as well. The, the Zolo A500S is slightly slimmer compared to the Pioneer P2 but since the Pioneer P2 has a large 1700 mAh battery it seems that it is thicker because of the same only. Talking of the build and the form factor both have a power or wake up key on the right hand side, a volume rocker on the left hand side. They both have a 3.5mm audio jack on the top and micro USB ports for charging as well as data transfer. Bottom is again clean for both and the mic holes are situated at the bottom on both the phones. The speaker placements are also very similar with the P2 and Zolo A500S with both having rear speakers towards the bottom of the phone on the back. When it comes to display quality, none of these phones disappoint us. Both have very nice looking sharp display which comes with 800 by 480 pixels display resolution and both have very good contrast ratio as well as viewing angles. There is no complaint with the display in any of these phones as far as our experience is concerned with these two phones. Interestingly, they have the same Android Jelly Bean 4.2 on the offer so if you do a two finger swipe on the phone you will see the toggles whereas with one finger swipe you will see the notifications like this. They run Android Jelly Bean 4.2 right out of the box which means that you can install most of the latest application on these phones. The Android experience is more of stock in the Zolo A500s compared to the Geoni which has rounded icons with more iconography. So if you like custom icons you would probably like this interface better. Whereas if you like your phone to remain vanilla android then this kind of experience is slightly better. The camera performance on both these phones is satisfactory. They both take fixed focus pictures in good clarity. So I'll click the picture of same object with these two phones one by one and to show you a comparison of the camera quality on these two phones. So here we have picture of same object taken with the camera of Geoni Pioneer P2 on the top and the Zolo A500S on the bottom here and as you can see the picture is coming out to be more vibrant as well as sharp on the Pioneer P2. So the camera of the P2 impresses us more compared to the camera 
that we find on the Zolo A500s. Talking of the benchmarks and performance, these phones are very close in terms of performance with the P2 giving a higher score of 10601 compared to 10187 that we get on the N22 benchmark on Geoni P2 versus the A500 from Zolo. Interestingly, on graphics benchmarking, we get better results on the Zolo A500s with 41 frames per second compared to 33 frames per second that we get on the Pioneer P2 on Geoni. There is a difference in the specification of these two phones. The Geoni Pioneer P2 is powered by a 1.3 GHz dual core processor compared to a 1.2 GHz processor found on the Zolo A500s which makes the Geoni slightly faster as reflected in the N22 benchmark scores. However, on the graphics, the Zolo A500s scores better with 41 frames per second graphics rendering on the A500s. On the storage capacity as well, both phones come very close to each other with 4GB internal storage on both these devices. They both have an expandable memory slot so you can expand the memory by up to 32GB by adding a memory card to these phones. Talking of the gaming performance, both phones come very close with the kind of graphics as well as gaming performance they have on the offer. We have done separate gaming reviews for both these phones. Check out the separate gaming reviews in the links provided in the description below this video for the gaming review of the P2 as well as the A500S. Summarizing our comparison, the Geoni Pioneer P2 is faster, has a better processor whereas the Zolo A500S is sleeker and has better graphic. They both come very close when it comes to pricing but the battery life of Geoni P2 as well as the loudness of speaker is better on a Geoni P2. Overall we find Geoni P2 be slightly better than the Zolo A500s. So it's really up to you if you prefer larger battery or a sleek phone with better styling with lesser battery with more graphics performance but less overall CPU performance. This is all we have on our quick hands-on comparison video. If you like our video, please press the like button below for more such videos. Please press the subscribe. This is your host Rohit Kurana signing off. Thanks for watching.